Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. So, um, we are gonna, yeah. So, <laughs> as you can see, if you are a Babe Box subscriber, you know what this is. Because it's a very unique bubble mailer here. Um, but this is my very first Babe Box from the Honeybee Shop. And I'm super, super, super excited. Especially because this month, the pictures that Shan's been posting, um, yeah. I'm like, really, I can't wait to get into this. Um, yeah, so let's just, let's open her up. So, I was going to become a Babe Bops, Babe, Babe Bops, Babe Box subscriber uh, a few months ago, and I just kept putting it off and putting it off. And, uh, then Shan released the theme for September. Let's see if I can get this open and stop, you know, shaking the camera all over the place. Okay. Yeah, so then Shan released the theme for September, and I was like, um, that's the most me thing I've ever seen in my life. I'm going to need that. Oh my god, oh my god. Ah! Okay, you ready? Oh my god. So number one, I'm saving this and I am reusing it to send happy mail because this is so pretty. Okay. I am also saving this beautiful pocket with the snap here because I can reuse that for a variety of things. So I love the packaging. First, like, first impression, love the packaging. There's like very minimal waste. Um, I mean, there's no waste for me. Like I'm reusing this to mail stuff to my friends and I'm gonna use this at home to hold die cuts and papers and whatever. So great job on that. Look, look at that. You kidding me? Okay. Oh my God. I don't even know where to start. I'm going to scream. Oh my God. These are the papers. Okay. Let's just start just the way it, just the way it comes. Okay. So at the top here, we have babe. How pretty is that? It's our little journaling card. Oh my gosh. And it says, thank you so much for subscribing to the babe box. And then it just tells you, um, yeah, what comes in it? And then you have, oh my gosh, I'm in love with this. Oh my God, when Shan posted these online, so these are sticky notes, and when she posted the picture, I was like, I cannot wait for those to come. Look at them. Oh my God. I am, I am so excited for this sticker book. I can't. Oh my God, the pin. No, oh my God, it's a magnet. It's a freaking magnet. Oh my God. Are you actually kidding? Okay, so this is the sticker book. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Love the packaging. Holy crap. Um, yeah. These are so Oh, <laughs> these are so pretty. Oh, my. Oh, you know I love me some functional boxes. Oh, yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh. oh, my God. And they're like die cut icons. Stop. Oh my gosh, these are the little game controllers. Oh. Oh my god. This is so exciting. I, I'm so excited. Oh my god, these are all so freaking pretty. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Okay. Shan, um... You knocked, you knocked it out of the park. This is just, wow, I cannot wait to start using this stuff. This magnet, watch this. I'm about to use this right now. This is my B6TN from the Honey Bee Shop. And I saw Shan post this online, but before I show you that, I wanna give a quick shout out. 
These three absolutely adorable, beautiful stickers um, are from my sister-in-law. So find her on Instagram at ckatepaint, and I'll put that on the screen. I'll put a link in the description box. This is her original artwork that she made into stickers, and she also has prints that you can buy. Um, they have, she, she also has a, um, she's in a partnership with another creator and they run um, a company called Brush and Letter Co. And they do like live events. So basically like, for example, you would, you know, if you had a wedding, you could hire, you know, my sister-in-law, Kate, and her partner to come and they would create a uh, unique portrait from your event. So you get a nice keepsake. Um, her partner does the lettering. So she does the actual painting and then her partner does the beautiful lettering on there. Um, it's really awesome. So just want to give a shout out to my lovely sister-in-law. I'm obsessed with these stickers. The quality is great. And I knew I had to put them on the front of my B6. And then this is just a random koala boba sticker I found at Box Lunch. So I saw Shan post, just ignore this right now, it's kind of a mess, but she posted that she had put her magnet on here. And I was thinking about trying the same thing. Okay, so, oh my God, look at that. Um, tell me that's not adorable. So yeah, I'm gonna redo my pockets later with, I got all these new die cuts, I've got, I wanna redo these pockets. So I'm just gonna shove everything behind here and deal with it later, but holy crap, how beautiful is that magnet? All right, back to the big box. I am so freaking excited for these die cuts because you get so many and they are stickers. So you can use them just for like decoration in your pockets or whatever, or you can use them as stickers. And they are, they are waterproof, so you can put them on your cup. Um, but she does recommend not putting them in the dishwasher because the it messes with like the foil. And I have two very specific cups that I put stickers on that I hand wash. I do not put them in the dishwasher. Um, <laughs> I was so excited for that goth juice. It's so cute. Now the only thing is like deciding where to put these. Um, I want to put them all on everything. Like, oh my God. This is so queen. Like, the, oh my God. I can't, I can't even deal with this. Look at that. This is my favorite. Look at her. Look at her. I'll look through these better later. I just, I can't even. They're so cute. They are so stinking cute. I'm definitely gonna put some of these on my water bottle. I'm definitely gonna put some on my um, catch-all cover. I. Yeah, this one mm, might be a personal favorite. So beautiful. Great job, Shan. You are so talented. Holy crap. Okay. Now, these are reusable. This is, not these are. This is reusable sticker paper. And it is sized for a mini happy planner. But I have a... Um, classic size nine disc disc bound planner. So what I'm gonna do, I'll show you right now, cause it's right here in front of me. So I just started keeping, um, this was like an old sticker sheet that I used all the stickers and just peeled the backing off of and I use it like when I'm doing my layouts every week. But it's kind of like beat up and it's got some parts coming up. So I'm gonna get rid of this now that these are here. Um, and what I'm going to do is, so I actually have a, this is my catch-all, and then I have a eight disc, uh, half letter disc bound planner, um, more like a notebook. I, It's kind of a hybrid. This is what I use for social media, um, and I'm going to put some in here as well, even though with this, with social media, I don't do that much decorating usually because I, I need this to be like total brain dump, like just ugly, like taking the pen to the paper, like scribbling and all that. But 
I am going to keep a couple of these in here because you get 25. That is such an awesome deal. So I'm going to open this bad boy up. And, oh, it's so nice. How smart is that? So what I'm going to do in my nine disc here is just pop a couple of these in, maybe, maybe three. And that way, when I sit down and do my layouts every week, I have this paper already right here. I don't need to worry about getting wax paper or anything. It's already punched and it just goes, it goes right in there. That is very, very smart. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna do the same thing here. You can see I have a couple of old, these were from, um, I don't even know what they were from at this point. Probably keep those because they're not too banged up, but I'll put a couple of these in here, and then the rest I'm gonna put on um, just a set of discs that I have laying around, and then these will be my reusable sticker sheets. These are awesome. I perceive myself having these for quite some time. All right, and then the last thing we have here, I'm super excited. It's our beautiful papers. So I believe there's acetate and vellum in here. Oh my. Yes. Oh, ooh, ooh, baby. How beautiful is that? Come on now. Look, look at that. Mm, you get two of each. Oh, okay, so there's actual, like this is like car stock. All these are, so you get two of each. And they're beautiful, oh, the back. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. And then you get these, the bows on the back, so cute. And you can do so much with these, like, I could use these in my B6, I could trim them down, and use them like as dashboards. I could cut out pieces and use them in layouts. I could, I could do a lot, like there's a, <laughs> You can make a cover out of this. Like there's a lot of uh, a lot of possibilities. And then you get your acetate and vellum. Oh my god. So this is the acetate and I am absolutely in love. It is beautiful. Look at it. Yeah, I think this puppy's going to have to go in my B6 like right now. I'm going to have to trim it down a little bit. And then this is the vellum, it's so pretty. So yeah, both of these are definitely going in my B6. I just need to trim them down just a hair. They come eight and a half by 11, which is great because you can do whatever you want with them. Um, you could honestly, if you had like a letter size planner, you could just punch it or um, whatever and just stick it in there. But I am probably gonna use these in my TN they're so stinking pretty. Everything is so pretty. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna actually put these back in here just to protect them for now. Later I'll put them, uh, after I trim them or whatever, I'll put them in my TN and then the cardstock. I have some cardstock in a drawer, so I'm gonna get that all organized later, but I'm just struggling to, it's always hard to get stuff back in the little plastic sleeve. It's like, it reminds me of like putting a vinyl record back in the sleeve. It just, I always have a hard time. I'm probably just going to put all this away for right now, to be honest, and go through it later when I have some more time. I am just, I mean, this is my favorite shade of purple and... I just, I'm just in love with everything. Like, I just, yeah. I don't even know what to say. Okay, and then as far as the die cuts, um, I am going to organize them. So what I do, um, just as of like very recently, like I got this cute little um, dish and I took all the die cuts that were like, the same and just paper clip them together so they're all nice and neat and easily accessible. So I'm gonna do the same thing here. I'm just gonna to group together like these, you know, put them all together and, and clip them and um, decide what I wanna do. I'm 
I'm debating with this one if I want to put it on my water bottle or if I want to put it I can't decide it's hard it's really hard to decide like yeah and I'm gonna put all of these together these are so unbelievably pretty it's like stupid how pretty these are and I love how many you get so like like look these these are identical these are identical so I can put one in my water bottle and have one for something else and the great thing is you get digitals of everything so if you have a printer at home, um, you can print everything and make more. Like you don't run out because you have the digital files, which I think that's really awesome that she provides that. And then you can like create your own stuff. You can just, you know, have fun with it. Like that's very, very exciting. And I think that's a great thing that, that uh, the Honey Bee Shop provides. But yeah, I'm just gonna kinda group all of these. Yeah, cause I'm already telling you right now, like I'm probably gonna end up printing more of this one cause this one might be my favorite. I just, I love her jacket, her hair, the freaking heart, uh, Patches on her elbows, like, come on now. Put this over here. Got my goth juice. I'm definitely gonna put one of these on my water bottle, cause that's like so meta. Put a water bottle on a water bottle, you know, cause that's hilarious. So I think I'll <laughs> probably do that. Um, oh yeah, and I have two babe. So I have this big babe one that's got like hollow sparkles and then I have this one with a white background. So that's cool. Get some variety there. Oh my God, these are, these are everything. Everything. I feel like a kid playing one of those like matching games, like. Oh my gosh. This jacket though, can I? Can this jacket be like a thing? Like, can that be a an actual thing? Oh my god. Obsessed. Obsessed. Oh wait, that one's different. Put the bows together, put the goth juice. Goth juice, get your goth juice. Mmm, so pretty. Yes. So then I'll go in and I'll paper clip them. Um, get them all nice and organized. And uh, then decide, you know, where I want to put them. It's hard to... They're all just so beautiful. It's hard to decide. Um, I think... You know what? This one, like... Look at their little bag. It's got little bat wings on it. It's like just the little details are just so... Oh my god. And the different skin tones I absolutely love. I, ju I just lo I love everything. So, the verdict. Is this worth the $30 price tag? So you pay $30 and then you pay shipping, which will vary depending on where you live. Uh, for me, it was about $6, so it was $36. Is this worth the price? 100%. Um, I mean, I had no doubts that it was all going to be beautiful because I've seen uh, like pictures online and stuff, but until you get it in your hands, you don't really see just how quality everything is. Like, In addition to the artwork being like, top notch like just the quality is and I, i'm not getting paid to say this i just want to let y'all know like if you're thinking about subscribing to the babe box by the honeybee shop i think it's a wonderful company great values it's a small business i love supporting small businesses um i just i just love everything i just there's so much you get so much for that price point you know um like i said the packaging is top-notch I really really love that you get 
this cute uh, bubble mailer that I can reuse. I already know what I'm using it for. Send one of my planner friends something. Um, and then you get like, even this I could reuse, you know, like I love reusing scraps and stuff. So, and then I love that you get this with the, with the snap so you can store everything together if you'd like. You know, if you're somebody who wants to just keep all your bait box contents in one thing, you can. Then you can just stick this right in your planner card or on a shelf or something. Um, for me, I'm going to end up, you know, kind of taking it apart. But for right now, it's great to keep it all in one place. So, 10 out of 10. I, I love it. I just absolutely love it. And I did renew for October. So, I'll be getting the Blush Baby box. So, if you are, I, I believe that's what it's called, Blush Baby correct me if I'm wrong. But if you're interested in that, um, make sure you subscribe and ring the bell so you get notifications whenever I upload. Um, and I will definitely be doing, like I said, an unboxing of the um, October Babe box because I did renew it. And I'm very glad now that I did renew it because I, I mean, like I said, I, I had high expectations. I knew it was going to be nice, but like just seeing everything in person is like, Oh my, <laughs> it's so pretty. So anyway, um, yeah, very, 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 very impressed. All right, well, thank you guys again. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Follow me over on Instagram at Planning with Cass to see more. Uh, be sure to follow C. Kate Paint and Brush and Letter Co. on Instagram as well. Follow the Honeybee Shop on Instagram. Anybody else? I don't think so. Not, not now, anyway. <laughs> All right. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.